The next thing is if you got some disposable cash, you want to exist on the <laughs> you exist on the good side of life. So text messaging. Let's go back again. Uh, shame 101. Be honest. Who does not text message? Come on, raise it up. Be honest. All right. What I try to tell people is that I often say, why don't you text message? And I often get, what do I need a text message for? And the thing that I now can take you to for the very first time is, it's very similar to email, but it's more convenient and it's more relevant. Those who text message, whether they know it subliminally or consciously, they know that when they get a text message, they will check it more compulsively and or above an email. They also know that's because most of the time, text messaging is reserved for your friends and family. Convenient. A lot of people have gotten really long emails that you groan when you see how long it is. You're like, my God, just call me, man. What makes SMS so beautiful is it really slam dunked the convenience factor. It was quick, it was simple, it really slam dunked the relevancy. But it's fun. At the end of the day, the reason why teenagers love this, it's fun. It's short, simple, to the point. I promise you, if your employees and your donors communicated like this, you would have so much more time because you wouldn't waste it reading these long emails.